is your Central Coast News Source at 5. Memorial Day is a time to honor those who fought and lost their lives for our country. And the California Highway Patrol says it's also time to talk about teen driving safety. Good evening and for Spencer Washburn, I'm Jake Reiner. And I'm Amanda Gomez. Law enforcement agencies refer to this time of year as the 100 deadliest days for teen drivers. While we're trying to be safer on the roads today, it's truly a day to remember our fallen heroes. Here on the Central Coast and across the United States, people took time to honor the men and women who gave the ultimate sacrifice. Crews there aren't sure yet how they'll fix the giant holes and golfers are playing around them understandably. Wow. Unbelievable. Look at that. I mean, Amanda, you could play golf out there, right? I that? could. I could. <laughs> I mean, we'd both be pretty good yeah, out there. Yeah, I mean, we wouldn't we wouldn't retrieve the golf balls at the end of it, no. but at least, you know, we would get a good score. I wouldn't want to be anywhere near that giant <laughs> hole. Are you kidding me? I know. Yeah. People still playing golf there. Crazy. Unbelievable. Dan, what Dedication. are we what's, what's it looking like out there? Well, we start The heat is coming. Yeah. Finally. Yeah, it's been yeah. it's been cool what for it's the supposed last couple to feel of weeks. Like, right? Yeah, this is much closer to normal for this time of year, if not a little above. Oh, wow, right. looks like a beautiful week ahead. Indeed. All right, thanks, Dan. You bet. More severe weather is expected after a series of storms dumped record rainfall on parts of Texas, Oklahoma, and other plains in Midwest states over the weekend. At least three people were killed, but he didn't want to jinx things by seeing his bride before she walked down the aisle. And this picture already has a lot of people talking. I think they said over 25,000 likes since he posted it on Unbelievable. Saturday. Unbelievable, and you can totally tell they are in sync with each other, knowing that that moment was a moment where they couldn't see each other's faces. Mm -hmm. Obviously, before the wedding, you don't want to do that, but that they both kind of felt it together. Really, really cool Powerful moment. and special. Yeah. Love it. All right, still ahead here, why one CBS talk show host will be taking a long break. Plus, a giant kangaroo shakes up one Australian town. Changing gears just a little bit, a giant kangaroo has taken over one Australian neighborhood. His name is Big Buck, or Big Buck. He's more than six feet tall and weighs up to 210 pounds. He's the last thing you'd expect to run into while walking in the suburbs, but residents say they've seen him walking around giving neighbors the creeps. Very big and I don't really want to take him on. He's got massive, massive muscles, big pecs and everything. Oh yeah, those big pecs. <laughs> Smaller kangaroos are often seen in the area and while Big Buck is more intimidating than most, residents say they're not afraid of Big Buck or his friends. Big and, Buck is cute. Oh, he's fantastic and I can't believe people in Australia would be afraid of that. No. Anyway, we're back at six. See you then.